Hi, this is Davina, and today I wanted to talk about fear of criticism, fear of being judged, fear of being attacked. This is something that I've had for a very long time, and this is something that I've experienced many, many times, being criticized, being judged, being attacked, being surrounded by the wrong people, and what I can say, it was no, no easy task to get rid of these fears, these anxiousness of being attacked or criticized. And in a way, and not in a way, it was a blessing that these things happened to me because finally I realized that it was none of my business what people, if, if people were judging me, criticizing me, verbally attacking me because it was all an illusion. And when you start to see it that way and start to see that they're just confused people, that actually if they're attacking me or judging me or criticizing me, I must be doing something right because you can only get attacked from those people who are doing less than you. Why would I feel afraid? And it's only an illusion, isn't it? So the truth is that it's none of your business, none of my business, what anybody thinks of me. And also it's a beautiful blessing and lesson to be learned. So as Sai Baba says, welcome adversity because in adversity is where that beautiful growth that happens, if it is happening, it's not an accident, it's there for a reason, and probably it's because it's an opportunity for you to forgive. It's an opportunity to, to dig down and say, do I have a subconscious belief that I am attracting this right now? If I'm afraid, if I'm getting triggered by this, is there something that needs to be healed in myself? Am I believing that I need to be afraid of this judgment? No, not really. It doesn't matter if people judge you or not. All that matters is what God thinks about you. And God says that you are perfect. You are love. You are the apple of his eye. You are the brilliant talent that he's made. It doesn't matter all of these things. And when you're in that peace, and that neutrality and that love, no matter what's going on around you, now you're powerful. And so take these things, the storm that might be happening around you, judgment, criticism, attacks, as just a storm. And watch yourself be in the eye of the storm because you are always in the eye of the storm. That's the truth. But are you gonna embody that truth, that peace by forgiving? by loving your enemies. That's the test that is being given to you. And you can be safe and, and feel love even more, even if adversity comes, because you know the universe is, there is no accidents in the universe. It's being brought to you for a lesson, for a gift, for a test to pass. It is a blessing. So with that, you can just smile and be centered. I'm not saying that it is easy because I've been through this a lot and I think I've finally come to a place of peace, multiple forgiveness of those that have attacked me, have judged me, when they, when they should have been supporting me, being compassionate towards me. Be the light. Show compassion to others. Be what they didn't do to you. Forgive. Become that enlightened being that you were always meant to become. Forgiveness, love, peace. Not caring at all about an illusion that it's not even them. It's not even them attacking you. With that said, uh, may you be at peace. May you be in love.
and the wisdom of what I just shared with you. Mwah. Much love to you.